but surely there can be none more valuable than to open a community church. Whilst many in our population strive for material success and its associated rewards that it may bring, they sometimes lose track of the fundamental rewards and securities, total security, that can be found through God. God's available to everyone. I can remember a few years ago I made some fairly rash statements, as how I have on the occasion to do, and people said to me, you want to be careful, you need to know some people in high places. And I thought to myself, they have no idea who I know in high places. And I believe that through that, God is available to everyone especially through organisations like the Albany Hills Christian Church. The, the Assembly of God Church is now well established in the Pine River Shire, having been operating for some eight years or more. And during that time, those eight years, eight new churches have been established and there has been tremendous support for mission workers both here and overseas. The church has a great track record, but this building only marks the beginning of a new and exciting era of community involvement and service in this district. The church certainly has the support of the Pine River Shire Council, and I can believe that I can speak for all my council colleagues when I say, we only wish we had more organisations such as your own. There are certainly many in our community who will benefit from involvement in your, your activities. And I, many times when I'm naturalising people, and I naturalise hundreds of newcomers to our country, and you may know that when they take, they can either take the pledge or the commitment. The, some people will take the commitment and take the Bible, the others just take the pledge. And I thought, we're lacking something here. It's for God and country and everything else. And I thought I needed to have to say some more about God and Christianity when we're all sitting around bringing new people into the country. So I decided that when we sang Advance Australia Fair, we would sing also that verse that says, with God our head and cornerstone. So that's part of our naturalisation ceremonies now. <laughs> I'm so pleased that you approve because this is a Christian country and without God and Jesus Christ, we cannot live or exist or survive. And there's some pretty troublesome people out there at the moment that really do need that help. And daily I have people coming to me with troubles of every different sort of imagination you could possibly think of. And then when they go, I think, and I say to them, I will pray for you. Because I know that if I'm stuck for it, he's going to fix it. And many, many times he has. And I believe that's the only way I can exist day by day. And I'm sure that a lot of you people here have managed to be able to be like that too. Ladies and gentlemen, it is indeed an honour for me to be with you tonight. Such an honour to open your church here in Albany Creek. And now it gives me the greatest of pleasure to officially open the Albany Hills Christian Church and my congratulations go to everyone involved in its construction and its development now and into the future. I am sure that God will continue to bless you all in the endeavours that lie ahead. Could I just ask you to bow your heads while I say a little prayer, please? Visit, we beseech thee, O Lord, this home, and drive far from it all the snares of the enemy. Let your holy angels dwell therein to preserve it in peace. 
and may your blessing be upon it evermore. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen.